They're in the gate. And they're off. Dance with the Devil hits the ground running and quickly builds a two-length, three-length lead right off the mark. Veers out just a bit, nonetheless, is well clear early on. Our secret agent comes away in second. Brittle and you is third. Hands up is fourth. Saint Station comes away fifth, chasing outside. And at the back is trapped in my mind as they chase Dance with the Devil down the back stretch run. Clear by a length and a half with four furlongs to go. Riddle and you on the chase inside second. Our secret agent alongside of that one. Two wide racing in third. Sensation three wide moving up into fourth. Hands up in behind while fifth. Trapped in my mind is at the back. The quarter in 22 seconds flat. Dance with the Devil rounds the far turn with our secret agent coming after that lead. St. Jason comes up four wide. Brittle and you is going to try and cut the corner down inside and does so. They're stacked across the track. Meanwhile, trapped in my mind is caught up and comes up on the far outside. Racing for the eighth pole and Brittle and you has scooted through down inside and ripped away to a three length lead with one for long to go. Hands up, runs up into second. Our secret agent is third. Trapped in my mind at the outside is fourth, but down to the wire. The rail skimming Brittle and you. Scores by four. Hands up was second. Our secret agent was third, and trapped in my mind was fourth. Number five, Brittle and you first. Number two, hands up was second. Number seven, our secret agent was third. Uh, number three, trapped in my mind was fourth. It's not official. They're in the gate. And they're off. Absolute love. And the outside post breaks out alertly. Lady Cleopatra is there. Sundress. Sundress for the inside post comes on through and will be the leader into the clubhouse turn. Lady Cleopatra moves up, second and outside. Absolute Love comes away third, tries to tuck in to save a little bit of ground. Color and Colonel comes away in fourth. Fun Patty and at the back is operatic. It's about four or five lengths from top to bottom as they move for the back stretch run. Sundress shows the way. Leads by a precise length with six furlongs to go. Lady Cleopatra tracking intently on the outside in second. The opening quarter, 24 and one-fifth seconds. Color and Colonel trying to sneak through underneath of Absolute Love. They're together third and fourth. Fun Patty's back in fifth. And Operatic is at the back. Now about seven lengths off the lead as Sundress rolls to the half-mile pole. Sundress cruising on a length and a half advantage. Lady Cleopatra getting closer now. Honing in is she. Lady Cleopatra's looking for the lead. And these two round the far turn together. Four lengths back. Absolute love is now third by another two. Fun Patty starting to pick it up. As Color and Colonel drops out of it, Operatic is still last with eight lengths to make up now. Racing for the top of the stretch, Lady Cleopatra saunters up alongside of Sundress and goes right on by. Lady Cleopatra to the front at the top of the stretch. Sundress is back into second. Absolute love trying to rally from third. Fun Patty and Operatic, there's one for long to go. Lady Cleopatra's got a four-length lead heading for the final. 16th. Operatic trying to run up into second outside of absolute love, but it will be Lady Cleopatra who wins it in the end by three lengths. Operatic got up for second. Absolute love was third.
They're in the game. And they're off. Pretty even start for the inside post. Bastet showing speed. Tourists like me is there. Messina at mid pack. Pauhana's up close. Farther out, Malibu Marley flying the colors for the downside draw. Tries to find her way over to the inside. So bias for the first time. Bastet shows the way almost by default. Messina's tracking with not a lot of pressure. Malibu Marley is three wide. Mill Flirt toward the inside is racing in fourth for the clubhouse turn. Tourist Like Me comes away fifth. Pauhan is racing in sixth. Flying the colors is seventh. El Masari finds a good spot down inside to save ground, running along in eighth. And then it's Heavenly Peace in ninth. Daddy Made Me Do It racing up three wide from tenth. Fashion Mo's eleventh. And at the back is Exablades about 12 lengths off the leaders. The opening quarter in 23 and 2. They're moving down the back stretch, and Bastet shows the way. Mild pressure from Messina on the outside in second, just outside of a half mile to go. A margin of three back to Malibu Marley, who's cruising up into third outside of Milfler, who's under pressure inside fourth, flying the colors. Progress up into fifth while three wide. El Masari's come off the hedge and is making progress as well. Daddy made me do it. Moving with that one. Those two closing in quickly. They're together fifth and sixth. Farther back, Heavenly Peace is launching a rally from far behind as well. Meanwhile, Bastet still in front. Bastet coming for the top of the stretch, trying to fend them off. Flying the colors with a big move off the turn to the attack. Flying the colors. Daddy made me do it's in behind. El Masari trying to get on track late. Malibu Marley goes to the hedge for the final furlong, but flying the colors kicked away by three. Flying the colors in front, heading into the final 16th. El Masari's finishing fast. El Masari trying to run down. Flying the colors, 50 yards to do it. Flying the colors. El Masari photo. Nose is up and down. El Masari or flying the colors. Farther back, Daddy made me do it. Photo finish. Number four, El Masari was first. Number 12, Flying the Colors was second. Number 10, Daddy Made Me Do It was third. And number nine, Malibu Marley was fourth. It's not official. They are in the gate and they're off. Improbable story for the outside post. Breaks out well. Creekmore is also there. Archability down inside as Johnny Cab backs out to be fourth in the early stages. Albert's Barn comes away three lengths farther back in fifth. It's My Bag Baby is away inside and sixth. Hit him, promise, at the back in seventh. So down the back stretch they go. Archability going head-to-head -head with Creekmore. And they lead by two lengths with four furlongs left. Johnny Cab angles outside the track from third, a little bit wide onto that turn. Farther out is Improbable Story. Fourth and moving up. 
It's my bag, baby, saving every step of ground, but is under a drive to keep within four lengths of the lead and three for longs to go. Then it's Albert's Barn and Hidden Promise around the far turn. The opening quarter was a contested 21 and four fifth seconds. Creekmore grabs a narrow lead right at the quarter pole. Archability tries to cut the corner off the turn. Johnny Cab is there. Improbable story down the center of the track. Hidden Promise putting in a late run. It's my bag, baby, dives down inside. It's wide open for long to go. Archability tenuous lead. Johnny Cab is there. Hidden Promise continues to close. Albert's Barn is my bag, baby. 100 yards left. Johnny Cab short lead. Hidden Promise surges outside. Archability at the rail. Photo! Johnny Cab and Hidden Promise. Good bobs for both. Archability was third. It's tight for fourth. Number four, Johnny Cab was first. Number seven, Hidden Promise second. Two, Archability was third and one. It's my bag, baby, finished fourth. It's not official. They're in the gate. And the rough. Chili Nelson, slow start, so too, Loverboy, off near the back of the pack for both of them. Suspect and Jerry's got aces, and their outside is for better or worse. Those three cross the track. Here comes Begin to Begin. Scooting through down inside, and right at the rail is Magic Mo racing up into fifth. Chili Nelson at that slow start is tugged all the way up to be sixth. Don't Need a Name is running along in seventh, just at a digital star, who's now eighth. And then it's YY, Paul Y, far outside in ninth by four. Mr. Class is back in tenth by another two. And at the back of the pack is Natural History and Loverboy. So round the far turn, 21 and two-fifths. A swift opening fraction, and Suspect seizes control right outside the quarter pole. Jerry's got aces, trying to keep up, keep up back into second. Begin to begin is coming on from third. Digital Star honing in with a wide rally from fourth off the turn. For better or worse, has a shot right in the mix. Three sixteens to go. Suspect trying to see it out. Digital Star continues to roll. Here comes Digital Star on the outside. Natural History from last earlier. Natural History's finishing very fast. In fact, Natural History's finishing best of all. Natural History rolls down the center of the track with an emphatic late kick to win it by four. Digital Star second. Suspect and begin to begin. They're in the gate, and they're off. Angelus Warrior went way to the outside rail soon after the break. 
Let me know toward the inside breaks. Well, Prefect is there. Jurgen comes on through. Kid Mercury not far behind. Checkmate splits rivals and comes on through to take over now. Table is not far behind. Third in the outside. Tight pack, though. Bias the first time. Checkmate over to the hedge to set the pace. Kid Mercury is right there running in second. Table is three wide in third. Spanish Kingdom tucks in behind to be fourth. Let me know is racing in fifth. Jurgen is back in sixth. Buy me candy in a bit tight there. Had to steady briefly running along in seventh. Angelus Warrior is eighth. Strong tide is ninth. Tiesto comes away tenth and is nine or ten lengths off the lead and a little bit wide. That it's prefix second to last and noble order the last of them all. The opening quarter, solid, 23, one-fifth seconds. Checkmate, heading down the backstretch run. Tabled, tracking intently on the outside in second. Spanish Kingdom, not far behind either. Third while in the clear. Kid Mercury, ground-saving trip so far. Tucked away fourth and at the inside. Angelus Warrior in the clear fifth. Jurgen right in the thick of it, running along in sixth. Buy Me Candy bottled up inside seventh. Tiesto's forced to go four, five wide, eighth, but moving now. Farther back, it's Let Me Know. Noble Order starting to wind up. Strong Tide is there, and at the back is Prefect. Round the far turn, Tables in front. Table comes on to take the lead. Spanish Kingdom is there. Angelus Warrior. Tiesto, five, six, maybe seven wide off the turn, but made a big move on the turn to get into the contention as they come off the turn now. And it's Spanish Kingdom who comes away with the lead. Angelus Warrior runs up into second. Table is third. Buy me candy. Clear sailing up the hedge from fourth. Tiesto trying to get on track in the final hundred yards, but Spanish Kingdom kick clear. Spanish Kingdom three length lead down to the wire, and they've won. Spanish Kingdom first. Angelus Warrior held second, Tiesto was third, and Jurgen was fourth. And they're off. Break even toward the inside. Racing for the lead. Sneaking out is away well too. Second at the rail. Me Mischief comes on to be third. Take Charge Angel comes away fourth. Unique Factor is now fifth. Bells to one is sixth. Princess Causeway seventh. And Spice Perfection last of them all. Down the back stretch they go and break even. Fleet footed up top. Leads by a length and a half over Mia Mischief. Tracking in second with four furlongs to go. Sneaking out is third at the inside. Far turn now. Break even. Blasts through that opening quarter mile in 21 and one fifth seconds. Leads by two with three furlongs to go. But Mia Mischief is on the move now. Picking it up. Second on the outside. Sneaking out is back third toward the rail. Unique factor. Rallies up into fourth within five lengths of the lead as they come off the turn. Break even. Still in front. A length and a half. Mia Mischief set down for the final three sixteenths and here she comes. Mia Mischief coming after break even. Bells the one putting in a bold late run. Here comes Bells the one right by Mia Mischief and right by break even. Bells the one to the front. Break even back into second Mia Mischief and unique factor. Bells the one from off the pace to win it by two and a half. Break even was second. Mia Mischief was third and unique factor was fourth.
Number four, Bells, the one was first. Number two, break even second. Eight, Mia Mischief was third. And five, Unique Factor finished fourth. Not official. And the rough. Bear Alley with a good beginning. Baker's Bay for the outside post. Sent hard to the front. The outside draw to the two-path to join Bear Alley for the run to the turn. And it will be Baker's Bay, just quicker, leads the way. Bear Alley tries to back off into second. Militarist on the outside up into third. Ashi Hobbs not far behind. Fourth in the early stages. Oceanic comes away. Running along in fifth. Mud Pie is sixth. Dreams of Yvonne is now seventh. What a country's back. Racing in eighth by three. Mau Mau is ninth. Tis the journey tenth by two more. Aztec Empire, the last of them all. The opening quarter mile on the board in 23 and four. Bear Alley is back in front on the inside of Baker's Bay. They go one, two with five for lungs to go. Ashiham tracking them from third. Militarist in the clear, racing in fourth. Oceanic cruising along fifth and down inside. Five lengths to make up from there. Three more back to What a Country, who moves up into sixth. Then it's Mud Pie, seventh outside of Dreams of Yvonne. The rest have to get going. They're on the far turn. Bear Alley, half mile, solid, 47 and two. Baker's Bay cranking up the pressure. Ashi Ham's under pressure. Militarist on the outside is fourth. What a country comes alive. Angles outside now fifth. Oceanic is down inside sixth. They're at the quarter pole. Bear Alley and Baker's Bay. What a country tries to come wide off the turn. Ashi Ham is there with Militarist. There's three sixteenths to go. Bear Alley and Baker's Bay brush at the three sixteenths pole. What a country's bearing down. Here comes What a country on the outside. Now third. 100 yards to go. Bear Alley. Baker's Bay. What a country continues to close. What a country to the front. Bear Alley battles to the wire, but what a country. From off the pace to one length winner, Bear Alley was second. Baker's Bay third, tight for fourth, Ashiham or Militarist. Still waiting for hidden facts. In the gate. And the Roth. Slight bobble for hidden facts. I'll handle the cash mid-pack. Broke well. Bingwa is there. Originator toward the inside. Unaqua comes away fourth while in the clear. Fame Feather had to back out of there in tight toward the rail. So it is Bingwa racing for the lead and heading for the far turn in front. Right there is Unaqua running in second. Originator down inside third. Hidden facts advancing up into fourth. I'll handle the cash is now fifth. Whimsical Muse racing in sixth. Dixie and Candyland wide of the turn seventh. Cardamon is eighth. Even beat on the move wide while ninth. Fame Feathers down inside tenth at the back are dance rhythms and Tia Floor. Round the far turn, Bingwa 
turns for home in front. It in fact with a three wide bit on the outside and Uniqua's in between. I'll handle the cash in behind trying to find a way out. Whimsical Muse down the center of the track. Dixie and Candyland is there. Originators boxed up in behind horses. Even beat. Farther out is Dance Rhythms. One for long to go. Very tight there for I'll handle the cash as Hidden Facts came out just a bit. Whimsical Muse clear sailing. Far outside Dance Rhythms. Here's the wire. Whimsical Muse up in time. Whimsical Muse was first. Hidden Facts was second, and four of them in the photo for third. Number 10, Whimsical Muse was first. Number... Hold all tickets in this race. Hold all tickets. There's a steward's inquiry and three riders' objections in this race. A steward's inquiry and three... Riders' objections in this race. The rider of the 12 against the 13, the rider of the 3 against the 12, and the rider of the 5 against the 13. Three objections and a steward's inquiry, not official, in this ninth race. The unofficial order of finish is 10, 13, 12, 5. 10, Whimsical Muse first, who's in the winner's circle. She is a four-year-old daughter of Oxbow from Ireland by a fleet Alex, owned by Maggie Moss, trained by Tom Amos, with winning jockey James Graham, bred in Kentucky by Calumet Farm, and a final time of 104.33. So once again, the order of finish is 10, Whimsical Muse first, 13 hidden facts second, 12 even beat third, and five I'll handle the cash fourth, but those results are not official. There are three objections in a steward's inquiry, 12 against the 13, three against the 12, and five against the 13 too. Hold all tickets.
They're in the gate. And they're off. Favorite Fearless broke near the back of the pack. Pluska Parfait broke well. Thirst for Life is there. Top speed outside. Farther out, Lone Rock races up. Kazi Ranga's in tight. Had to take up there a few times as they ran to the clubhouse turn. So it is Thirst for Life who opens up to lead a length and a half. Top Seed moves up into second on the outside of Pluska Parfait, who's now third. Lone Rock is fourth. Kazi Ranga continues in some traffic. Fifth, twelfth labor. Running along in sixth. Gunnett is now seventh. His mischief is eighth. Full of runs, saving ground inside ninth. Seek the Peak is tenth. And Fearless is last. About nine lengths off the lead. The opening quarter in 24 and 3. And a big long shot and thirst for life showing the way with five for lungs to go. Top seed tracking intently on the outside in second. Lone Rock right up and on this pace, three wide from third. Pluska Parfait tucked away, saving ground to the far turn in fourth. Twelfth Labor's fifth, Kazi Ranga sixth. Gunnett's on the move now. Gunnett started to launch a rally from the back of the pack. Seventh, sixth, fifth, now fourth. Gunnett with a blitz on the far turn, all the way up to challenge for the lead. In fact, Gunnett's made the front, so Gunnett... One furlong to the front. Big move there. Top seed running in second. Fearless winding up outside. Thirst for life trying to hang in there. Pluska Parfait shuffled back. Kaziranga 12th labor and seek the peak. Off the turn. Gunnett trying to sustain that rally. Top seed's battling on and Fearless is bearing down. One furlong to go. Top seed down inside to the front. Gunnett battles on. Fearless all the momentum. And now Fearless has taken over. And Fearless is opening up by the 16th pole. Fearless is a last to first winner by two and a half in the end. Top seed was second. Gunnett was third. Tight for fourth. Thirst for life for Seek the Peak. Number seven, Fearless first, eight, top seed second. Ten, Gunnett was third, photo for fourth. the rough in the old Forester Mint Julep Stakes. Awkward start for winning envelope off near the back of the pack. Juliet Foxtrot bro broke alertly and is angled way off the hedge. Four or five paths off the hedge for her bias the first time. Opening at the inside for Nay Lady Nay. Farther out is Elizabeth Way and Mitchell Road from that outside post is coming on to challenge two. Into the clubhouse turn they go. Juliet Foxtrot goes head to head with Mitchell Road and now Mitchell Road goes on with it. Elizabeth Way settles into third. Zafel from an outside post over to the hedge to be fourth. Varenka moving up into fifth. Nay, Lady Nay is down inside six. She's on the warpath, is racing in seventh. Secret Message comes away. Eighth, La Senor is ninth. Bow Recall racing tenth. Coco Channel back in eleventh by two. Hanale Moon moving up one spot from twelfth. And then it's Altia. And at the back is winning envelope. The opening quarter mile in 23 and three-fifths second. So it is Mitchell Road from that outside post to the head for the run to the far turn. Juliet Foxtrot sitting a perfect tracking trip second and outside. Farther out, Elizabeth Ways racing in third. Zafel's inside fourth. Nay, Lady Nay finds a seam in between while fifth. Varenka picking it up with a three-wide bid up to be fifth now. She's on the warpath down inside six. Secret Message trying to muster up a late bid seventh. And it's Lawson Yard down inside eighth. Coco Chan on Hanale Moon. They come for the top of the stretch. Juliet Foxtrot coming after Mitchell Road. They're one-two off the turn. Zafel pops outside and is putting in a bid with three sixteenths to go. Varenka fourth on the outside. She's on the warpath in behind. Bowie Crawl trying to come on late. La Senor is also there. Secret message far outside as well. Zafel strikes the front. Mitchell Road battles on. Juliet Foxtrot. She's on the warpath. Secret message outside. La Senor in between. Photo! Wow. Thrilling stretch drive. It might have been secret message. Also there was La Senor. Also there was she's on the warpath and a host of others.
photo finish. Number seven, Secret Message was first. Number five, Lasagna was second. Eleven, Zafel was third. Four, she's on the warpath, was fourth and eight, Altif.